This is the one I'm gonna choose. What do I do? I grab this, Command C. I'm gonna go ahead and look for a YouTube converter. So I'm gonna type in YouTube MP3 converter. I'm gonna just check them out. This is my favorite one. I'm going to right click, click, and then Command V to drop it in. And I want the MP3, so I make sure I pick that and I download the MP3. Don't buy any of this stuff. It's probably already downloaded down here. Your file is ready. Chrome has blocked it. Let me try again. This is the one I want to get outside. Okay, so be careful what, what is here. It already tells me to discard these. So I want to remember the words get outside because that's the name of what I'm looking for. So I'm going to go back to my desktop. And remember this file that I have all my things in, Video Vocab 1, in my own file? Well, I'm going to go to the downloads, get outside. <laughs> Sorry, that was not very helpful. So I'm going to type in get outside and it's going to start showing up and it is only going to be an mp3. So if I wanted to, I might even be able to say mp3. Did it come in? mp3 get outside. There it is. So yeah, I downloaded it twice. Instead of just leaving it in my downloads, I want to go ahead and put it back where all my other stuff is. And it's okay that I put it in with the videos. It's not a big deal. So now I'm going to go back to my uh, editing, and I need to get it over here again. So I'm going to right-click. I'm going to Import, or if you can't right-click and Import, make sure you go up here to File Import. I'm going to go find that same folder on my desktop and on my particular desktop and loads of videos to upload. But you're looking at your folder and there's my get outside music. And right now it's an MP3. Let's see if it likes it. And it says import failure. It does not like this MP3. Do not stress out. Please don't stress out. We're just going to take this mp3 that we already have in our folder. We're going to go to the very back and change that mp3, yes, you guessed it, to a WAV file, WAV file, what we recorded in when we were in the recording studio. It's going to ask me, do you want to change it to a waveform? Yes, I want to change it to a waveform. And then I'm going to go back to my imports. Yours is a little bit slower because you're not skipping from screen to screen. So here this time I'm going to do File Import, or you could right-click on that. It already knows where to go because this is the last time I was in this folder. And now here's the WAV file. I'm going to import it, and guess what? It took it. 